Charles from American Life three hundred sixty five. Let's talk about the winter vegetable radish. According to WebMD, radish is the most popular and healthiest vegetable. You can Google it. A lot of goodness. Radishes are an energy source of potassium and vitamin C, and do not contain many carbs and calories. I often grow radish because its bulb and leaves are edible. Since radishes are almost four seasons vegetables, you can grow radishes at different times, so that you can harvest radishes continuously. You can also eat radish leaves all the time, which is also good for making. Vegetables and salads. The biggest problem is to grow radishes and only get leaves without bulbs. I have a video that explains why no bulb in growing white radish. In that video, I explained the main reasons are too crowded, too little sunlight. And too fast growth, and a lot of nitrogen fertilizer in hot weather. Since I did not have much land to grow radishes, I had to plant seedlings in the ground. The best place for seedlings is underground, because the ground temperature and humidity. Are very suitable for seedlings. The pot is much cooler than the ground. Seedlings do not like cold. Since I plant radishes at a different time, so you can see some are babies, some are mothers, some are parents, some are <laughs> grandparents, and some are ready to harvest. We also plant radishes for different purposes. Some are for leaves only, like this, very crowded, and we want to harvest leaves for cooking vegetables only. And some for radish bulb only, like this. In order to avoid the problem of not forming bulbs, I found that the best way is to grow radishes in pots. In the seedlings, I plant the seeds in the ground. When it grows to three. Or four inch tall, you can move it to a large place or pot. To avoid being too crowded, you can grow radishes in the pot. I found that growing radishes in the pot in its second growth period is a very good method. You can also grow radishes on land borders, so it provides more spaces for the radish. In order to avoid too little sunshine, the pot can be moved to a place with more sunshine. To avoid overgrowth, you can limit. Or provide a small amount of radish compost or fertilizer. You can also reduce its leaves and let the radish focus on growing its bulb. Also, you can move the pot to a cooler place if the weather is too hot. In summary. Growing radish in a pot 
is a very good idea if you don't have much land. We have hundreds of videos in many aspects of American life. If you like our video, please click the logo to subscribe our channel and share with your friends. Your effort to help us encourage us to make more videos. Thank you.